gosh! Oh my gosh! <laughs> The Rubik's Cube was invented in 1974, but became big in the 1980s when the Ideal Toy Corporation was licensed to sell this toy. The Rubik's Cube is a mechanical 3D puzzle in which the player must get the same color on all six sides to win. It is considered to be the world's best-selling toy, and as of 2009, 350 million cubes have been sold worldwide. The Berlin Wall was a barrier constructed in Berlin, Germany, starting in August 1961, dividing the city into two sides, the East and the West, after World War II. The East was communist, controlled by the Soviets, while the West side was democracy, controlled by the United States, Britain, and France. The wall included guard towers, a no-man's land, an additional inner wall, patrolling soldiers, and electrical fences to ensure that no one could cross from their side. Many people tried to escape, however very few made it. As communism began to weaken in Europe, the wall also began to disintegrate. The wall began to open at checkpoints, allowing people to flee from east to west. Then suddenly on November 9, 1989, the East Berlin government officials gave up, opening the borders and allowing people to cross freely. People flooded the wall from both sides and huge celebrations were occurring in the streets of Berlin. Democracy had beaten communism. Mr. Gorbachev, tear down this wall. John Lennon was a famous English musician who gained fame as being one of the main founders of the well-known band The Beatles. He also had his own solo career in music and was a political activist and pacifist. On December 8, 1980, as he was entering his home in New York, he was shot by David Chapman. Lennon was coming back from a photo shoot and an interview for a music show. He was rushed to the hospital but sadly was pronounced dead on arrival. Due to his fame, Lennon's death caused grief around the world. Sales of his music skyrocketed in the months following his tragedy. Pac-Man is an arcade game developed by Namco. It was released on May 22, 1980. At its release, the other popular games were space shooters and sports games like Pong. Pac-Man is credited with being a landmark in video game history because it succeeded with these two games by creating a new, appealing genre that anyone would like. Pac-Man is also the highest grossing video game of all time, making nearly $2.5 billion in just quarters by the 90s. When one thinks of classical video games, Pac-Man comes to mind because it was one of the first innovations in the world of gaming. 